Many of us growing up wanted to become rich to give to the poor. Instead, many of us stay poor and give to the rich. I look at my friends and people I know, and I realize many Americans are heavily in debt and stressed. We are severely underskilled compared to our talents, cheating ourselves of our true lifetime earning power. Many of us work at jobs we will hate until we die or retire with little or no savings, perhaps with a bankruptcy along the way. Credit card debt, which for the first time hit $1 trillion in 2023, as well as student loans, are crushing a generation from being able to buy a home, invest, and in decades from now, be able to retire comfortably. It's not just the younger generation struggling. 50% of women and 47% of men between the ages of 55 and 66 have no retirement savings. And for those that do, the amounts are paltry. In many cases, less than 10% of what people actually would need to retire. It's not entirely our fault. For one, we're bad at money. We want to spend now, buy things we don't need to impress others and take unnecessary risks. Our brains simply conspire against us as we were never built evolutionarily for easy consumer credit. We are also financially exploited. Companies know about our weaknesses and prey on them. The science of selling debt and addiction is finely tuned and precise. We are targets of multiple overlapping trillion dollar financial industries who profit from keeping us in debt, vulnerable, and addicted to lifestyles we cannot afford and which in some cases are literally killing us. Our financial system is a way to transfer wealth from those who can least afford it to the rich. Even though we all struggle at some point, we feel isolated and alone, full of shame. Most of us feel we are just bad at money. We hide our struggles from our partner, our friends, and family. We also hide from ourselves. It doesn't have to be this way. I want everyone to know how to build sustained wealth, including wealth that will transform your family, your future generations, and your community. You can attain wealth with knowledge that you should have, but probably don't have. Simply put, no one ever taught you, and if they did, you probably learned the wrong lessons. People just like you are building wealth, and they are only different because they know the things you were never taught. That is why I created Demystifying Wealth. Demystifying Wealth is a blueprint and friendly guide how to end this financial shame, desperation, and dependence. It seeks to put everyone on track to achieve their dreams, which begins with financial security. How can typical Americans transform their futures from bleak drudgery and indebtedness to freedom, independence, and financial security? I want to show everyone high school age and above the secrets used by a small portion of Americans to achieve real long-term wealth. Demystifying Wealth consists of video courses you can watch at your convenience and re-watch later, live events such as office hours, webinars, and guest speakers, a community of like-minded people for questions and discussions, curated content and resources with more to be added over time. There will be six essential sequences of courses. The first eight courses are called Personal Finance One. If you give me 10 hours of your time in, this video, in these video courses, you will learn how to understand and avoid common money mistakes, where to invest for the best short, medium, and long-term results with minimal effort, how to understand stocks and bonds and invest in ETFs, index funds, and target date index funds, how to do an annual personal financial health checkup, including your credit score, debt, and net worth, the basics of the tax code and retirement accounts like Roth and traditional IRAs and 401ks. How to set up, use, and automate bank, retirement, and brokerage accounts.
how to get out of debt and create an emergency fund, how to proceed in truly desperate financial situations, including when you are near bankruptcy, how to create a customized plan to save for your priorities and build long-term wealth through investing. I will teach you the secrets the wealthy know and teach their children, including what I teach my children, at least when they listen to me. But the truth is, there really are no secrets. Everything I will teach you is evidence-based and proven. I will focus on basic habits and strategies. You need to make more, spend less, and invest the difference. Based upon that, that will allow you to achieve your short, medium, and long-term goals and live a wealthy life, a wealthy life being more than just about money. Slow, steady, automated investing in low-cost index funds over decades will be enough for most people. It turns out small exponential decisions create outsized returns over time. If you don't believe me, watch Class 102, What is $100 Worth? Even investing $100 a month if you start early enough can lead to over a million dollars at retirement, and that's just $100. In future sequences, we will go deep on the other parts of wealth. We will cover more than just simply financial literacy. How can one live a wealthy life in other areas, including your career, learning, relationships, creativity, and building businesses and nonprofits and giving back? Although it's tempting to jump forward, I urge you to start here. Rarely can you just earn your way out of problems as the bad habits will just follow you. As I will tell you in a moment, I grew up poor, but am no longer. The problems I see in my friends who grew up like me are not dissimilar to people who were law firm partners to me, making over a million dollars a year. In the end, everyone basically is faking it and living broke. So who is demystifying wealth for? If you are just starting out and want to learn correct habits from the beginning, this is for you. If you are someone well on your way and you've made mistakes, even serious mistakes, it's also for you. And if you're someone who is upwardly mobile and has good habits but wants to learn more, demystifying wealth is for you as well. In short, demystifying wealth is for anyone who wants to feel in control of money. I can teach you the fundamentals in a handful of lessons with more advanced courses coming later. You don't need a math background. You don't need to feel you're good at this. Applying the lessons, however, will take some fortitude. You will need to understand how to create good habits and systems and how to defeat the demons that make us bad at money. I spend a lot of time on those two issues. How do you create systems and processes and habits to make yourself be good at something that defeats most of us? Let me tell you about me and my journey. My name is David Frazee, and I grew up in rural Kansas under the poverty level. My family made $6,700 a year, suffered a bankruptcy, and a number of financial setbacks. I know the shame of not having things and missing experiences others could afford. I know the daily gnawing stress of not knowing if there will be enough. I know how it feels to be on the outside, looking in at what feels like an unfair and exclusionary system. This is the house I grew up in from age 10 until college. My father died recently, and my sister and I talked about having the local fire department burn it down as a practice exercise. It's actually too close to the house next door for that, but it's a fate it richly deserves. No one should live like this. Today, I am far from that house. I'm a former partner at some of the world's largest law firms and former successful entrepreneur, including at one company I took public. Today, I'm a managing partner to leading global venture capital fund. If you want to learn more about me and my life story, look at the about page on the site. There's a lot of details, including a full CV. I did get out of poverty, but that's actually unusual. The belief that Americans are economically mobile is a myth. Most stay where their parents are, and in a first in American history, many are now making less than their parents. There are consequences. Many believe the American dream has died 
and feel betrayed by an unfair and unjust system. I personally believe these feelings have a major role in the rage and divisiveness in America today, both on the left and the right. There was a time we believed in shared prosperity and opportunity, not despair and fatalism. The answer is to create wealth for everyone. And the answer to create wealth for everyone is hidden in plain sight. I can't fix the big things. I cannot end poverty. I cannot fix education, family structures, histories of centuries of inequality or large structural issues. I can, however, make the knowledge I have accessible to anyone who wants it. And doing so can transform families and communities for generations. I spent a lifetime learning these hard lessons and I'm still learning every day. I feel economically bicultural is I had nothing and felt the indignation and unearned privilege. And now I see how it works from the inside, how the wealthy become and stay wealthy and teach their children. I, in these classes, will address all audiences. Whether you're poor, middle class, or wealthy, I'm going to have something for you and I hope to speak to you. I also want to point out that I am a white guy and many of the American dream themes I just discussed may feel foreign to you if the dream excluded you in the past and if you believe the dream was never meant for you. If you believe that, I will do my best to change that. Why am I doing this project? I grew up with the mantra, be the person you needed to save you when nobody did. Nobody saved me from poverty and no one showed me the skills. I don't want anyone to feel that way ever again. We all have one life and I decided to spend the last part of my career rather than running more venture funds, paying it forward. Wealth is a key life skill everyone should be taught and teaching everyone is part of my wealthy life. If you do not know the rules of wealth, you will receive only a fraction of the benefits otherwise available to you in this world. So where do you go from here? First, sign up for an account. It's free and gives you access to a lot of material, especially over time as we begin to have regular webinars. Next, continue watching these introductory videos. The next lesson talks about the core values of demystifying wealth. Then I give you an overview of Personal Finance One, each of the eight classes in the sequence. Next, I give you an overview of the future courses coming after Personal Finance. I then go over how the site works, including options to make the site more affordable, and then I give you some parting thoughts, which include if you're in a lot of debt. There are also two free classes available right now for registration. 101, why are we bad at money? And 102, what is $100 worth? These are foundational classes. One of the primary barriers to our becoming wealthy is our own minds and the things that we do to make this hard. This class 101 addresses that. Class 102, what is $100 worth? Talks about the exponential and compound nature of money and why small investment decisions can have extraordinary results over time. Please, I beg of you, watch these classes. If you want to continue, I of course encourage you to sign up and actually watch the paid classes. Personal Finance One is what I recommend you sign up for in its entirety, not individual courses. Now, you can do the individual classes as one-offs, but I think you should do them in the order I created them. There's actually a method to the madness. If you sign up for the entire sequence of Personal Finance One, you also get gold membership, which gives you access to private Q&A that only members have access to, where you can ask me and my staff questions, as well as what I call an atrium, which is a discussion forum where you can talk with us and other like-minded people. At the end of the day, Realize your future is in your control. You and you alone are responsible for what happens to you financially. No one is coming to save you. Generational wealth, community changing wealth has to start somewhere and with someone. And it turns out that someone is you.